Well, 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 let's shave my beard. <laughs> Alright guys, let's get started, create our project, it's gonna be delete one uh, part, part, yeah, and let's do this percentage text, copy the size, paste it in here, and here, I'm gonna call the layout game, and this one gonna be game sheet, and here we need to have some layers, first one is gonna be PG, which is empty, and second one is face, third one is beard, and the last layer we want is eraser. Okay, so in the face layer, I'm gonna add another, a new sprite in here, which is my awesome face, and I'm gonna put it in the middle of the screen, just like this. And we're done with this layer. Let's go in beard, and in here we need to have a beard object, beard object, and I'm gonna put it in here. Let's call this beard. This one needs to be face, and in eraser we need to have our eraser object, which is an uh, which is a sprite. And let's call this eraser. And also, we need to go in layer beard and have our mask, eraser mask. The collision is okay, you can see. I'm gonna change the size to 110 and 110. And let's call this mask, okay? So now we have the objects in here. In the layer beard, we have two kind of objects. This is the mask that gonna uh, hide everything, uh, everything in Z order lower than this object. So you can see that this one is uh, in the in the back of this object, the mask object, and uh, the mask gonna do the job just like this. First, we need to go in here, set blend mode to destination out, and you can see that uh, it goes dark. Okay, okay, and for making it work, we need to go on the layer and enable this uh, this feature. Okay, and now you can see that it works. It hides the beard. Okay, and. Let's just uh, make the blend mode to normal because we want to see it in here and go in game sheet and let's start and uh, do the code, okay? So first, we need to go and create our group called start. On a sort of layout, we need to make the eraser, eraser invisible, okay? And also we need to destroy the uh, first object of mask that we have in here, okay? And also we need to have touch and here at touch and in here let's say is in touch, uh, eraser needs to be visible, okay? And eraser needs to go to the touch touches position touch that x and touch that y and uh, in every uh, every touch we do we need to create our mask object so in here let's create it create object mask in layer beard and position of touch.x and touch.y and mask uh, masks blend mode needs to be destination out just like this let's see all right you can see that it works very good okay and we can hide all of the <laughs> beard we have okay now if you make uh, 
if you make such game you need to know when uh, when level is completed okay for for knowing that we need to have another object in here so I'm gonna add it sprite and it's gonna be uh, 50 by 50 with a different color like this and let's make it 30 by 30 okay and it needs to be called for example checker okay checker and uh, we're gonna create a uh, different uh, several actually several object of checkers uh, in different position of the beard and when our mask uh, overlaps this object the object gonna delete and when all objects of when all checker objects deleted, the level is completed. Okay, so I'm gonna add in add them in here. You can see different parts. And yeah, just like this. Okay, so let's go in here and say if checker collided with mask, then needs to destroy and we need to have a function in here check level done and in here let's say if checker dot count is zero that means all all checkers deleted then our level is completed and somehow we need to show it i just gonna uh, make the opacity of the face to 50 and we need to call this after each checker delete it uh, after a few seconds just like this okay let's see oh we need to make the uh, checkers invisible so I'm gonna make it invisible let's run again okay you can see that oh <laughs> it worked and uh, also something else uh, if uh, if our touch ended we need to make the eraser invisible touch end make a uh, copy and paste in here make it invisible and also when you make uh, more more checkers on the uh, on the area you want uh, that that gonna be more precise and that gonna work better and also uh, gets more uh, RAM and needs more performance to run okay so because of the uh, because of the several objects that you created so this is it this is just the tutorial have fun with it